How's it going everyone and welcome back to the Dark Pictures Anthology. I'm your host Brett, I'm with my friend Okami, and we're going to do the fourth chapter, The Devil in Me. So let's let's get into it. New game. <laughs> you could also say The Evil Within, just to make that reference. Mm -hmm. Quiet on the set! For they have sown the wind, and they shall reap the whirlwind. Orsia 87. A choice has a consequence. Some decisions save lives. Uh, the next one you gotta read. But others... lead to... death. Just like that rat. The wheel Choose wisely. Is 264 feet, Jeff. Can you imagine it? I'm attempting to. I bet you can see for a hundred miles at the top. We should make that our first priority. Whatever pleases you the most. You please me the most. You mean you are not weary of me after <laughs> Good the entire Lord. day of marriage? I will never be weary of you. I shall hold you to that, my dear. <laughs> Is this Victorian Have London? Because it feels like Victorian London. I mean, I'm going to think I can know because I don't get out much. Isn't this grand? Well, they're not speaking in British accents, so Very I'm assuming nice. this is this is uh. Let's check in. Or I'm assuming they're on honeymoon in Victorian London. Hello, anybody home? Ching! Ching! Are we the only ones here? I'm sure ching, that was a ching. mad dash first thing this morning. Ching, Let's get ching, 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 ching. Just hitting his head on the bell and then just hitting it off the deck. Try again? I mean, just be careful. I might catch on fire. What, you never seen I <laughs> what, you never seen iCarly? <laughs> oh. Hmm. You're thinking. You're thinking. You're thinking. The fair will show us all sorts of wonderful things to come. But the only future I care about is ours. Talk like that makes me wish there was a way I could marry you twice. Okay, let's see here. I wish they'd hurry up so we can finally be alone in our room. <laughs> oh, do you now? Oh, Lord. Slow service. That means they're making sure everything is perfect. That's my Marie. Always finding that silver lining. My sincere oh. apologies. For both startling you and for making you wait. My attention was needed elsewhere. I promise from here on out it will be nothing but silver linings. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Please, sign in here. First time in Chicago, I'm going to hazard a guess. Oh, this is uh, the this is Victorian the fair, era yes, in uh, but in America. That's not all. Today is a very special day for us. Oh, <sighs> a honeymoon! How very, very lovely. Yes, today is the beginning of our honeymoon. Congratulations. In that case, an upgrade is in order. So this a is a pen. Sweet it is. Oh, well, uh, are the rates that much higher? <laughs> I think nothing of it. The same rates as your regular room. 
the upgrade is on us. You're our first honeymooners. How kind. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. Henry Howard Holmes. You have Are you related to Sherlock Mr. Holmes? Well, thank mm, you very much. Probably not. I designed and built most of it myself. You're an architect then? Architect, designer, builder, doctor, artist. I'm a man of many interests. Impressive. Please have a look around. We have sundries and gifts at the pharmacy counter. I'll take your luggage up to your room and ensure that everything is in order. Just make a note if you decide to purchase anything, and we will add it to your bill. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. We appreciate it. The pleasure is all mine. Now, what we got? What did I forget to bring? Hmm. Interesting. Oh, pardon me, miss. Careful, you. <laughs> My husband gets awfully cross with men who act fresh. Hmm. <laughs> he sounds like a ripe fellow. How's the marriage going? Lovely. <laughs> Thanks for asking. <laughs> well, let's just head up. I'm sure the room is ready. See anything good over there at the jewelry counter? Anything fancy? Wouldn't you like to know? Ding. No? Okay. When the creepy nit when the creepy when the oh, horror movie factor here. goes up by ten. I'm starting to think I've gone and married a thrill seeker. Ferris wheels, forbidden rooms. Are we looking for excitement? Perhaps. <sighs> Uh, why would you Nothing go into a private room? room? See what happens when you chase a thrill? If this is you trying to get out of the Ferris wheel. I know you won't be denied. Wait, what's that? All right, body. Most likely. Don't move. Oh shit, I forgot to change the settings. Fuck. I'm sure I'll be fine. Stay cool. I will have to. was a thrill. You won't think it's thrilling if we're sleeping on the street after getting kicked out of here. Let's go. I was gonna say, I might as well head back. Snooping around. Welcome, newlyweds, to the honeymoon suite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you kindly, Mr. Holmes. Do enjoy your stay. If you'll excuse me, I have 
work to return to. I'm sure we'll see each other again soon. So he's totally not sus. <laughs> Goodness, this place is fit for a king. Or my queen. Oh, you. Kiss this. Oh my god. That is not very wifely. Got him with the pillow. <laughs> pillow fight. Hey! <laughs> Bullseye! You asked for it. Alright, bring on, mister. <laughs> Should I be frightened? If you're smart. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Victory! <laughs> <laughs> you cheated! Uh, there's something I'd like to show you. I got this downstairs. It was half the price it should be. Oh, it's very nice. Ah, come on. The wa Does it suit watches me? are pretty good at keeping time. Mm hmm. It's lovely. You'll cut quite the dashing figure with it. It suits you well. Why don't you have that bath? I'm going to see about a shave. All right. A shave? It already looked like you had a shave. Yeah, is that a camera lens? Yep. Not really a camera lens, more like a... More like one of those, uh... Peepholes? Yeah. <sighs> Jammed shut. Maybe if we put a little weight into it. <laughs> yeah, I gotta change up the open sesame. <laughs> Thank you. Why don't you have a shave while I take a quick bath? Then we can reconvene. I know that word. It's French for something illicit. Shush. Shave. I think I forgot to pack my <laughs> razor and kit. I'm sure the pharmacy downstairs has them. Don't be too long in that bath. Don't you worry. Gotta find the shaving kit. Let's see here. Yeah, a little uh, hot and cold. Yeah, apparently I have this D-pad mechanic. Uh, what the? So what's in the where box? Where the fuck am I going? Okay. Um, apparently I can't seem to turn a corner. Uh, hello. Uh. Where do I need to go? What the fuck is going on here? Ah, that feels nice. <laughs> uh, hello? What the fuck? Oh! Is that you, darling? Jeff? Oh, are we playing another game? I can't see shit, game! I'm gonna stay relaxed. Uh, 
Uh, the game glitched out on me. I, I did it, huh? Back already? Yeah, I can't see what the fuck I'm doing! You know, this tub is awfully big. It, it didn't black out, I just can't see- I just can't I see where the fuck I'm going. Body. Oh. oh, there we go. Mm, that's Kinda. Nice. Maybe. Probably not. Ow. You don't know your own strength. Easy, dear. Jeff, that hurts. Uh, Hello, my dear. We got ah! oh, Hi. Come on. We don't Come want on, to game. The other guests. Oh, boy. The game drowned. I really thought you'd oh, have shit. a little more fun. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Kick the door down. There we are. Nice and quiet. Kick it down, it's made of wood. Oh, she dead. <gasps> what was I meant to do? What are you doing? If you've touched Maria, you're a bit late with that sentiment, good sir. Shit! Is there a problem, sir? Uh. I don't. Oh, hmm. shit. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, I fucked up. Hmm. Well, fuck me. Yes. <coughs> uh, can you open up the window in here? It's a little gassy. <laughs> It's always the first two. It's always the first two people in these games that that fucking die. Mm -hmm. Well, except in uh, freaking, uh, except in Little Hope, because you know Anthony. Uh, spoilers for anybody that hasn't watched that. Uh, Anthony was the bus driver, wow. so. Look at this. Oh, it's wonderful. Only the best for you, my dear. Mother would simply die. It's so I say, opulent. Uh, good man, do you work here? Hello. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Oh, God. Oh, uh, they weren't the first victims, and they won't be the last. Nope. Also, censorship music. I'm actually sad that people won't get to listen to the outro, though, or intro. Holy shit. Who's coming through the door? It's the curator. The merry go round goes round and round. Well, what is this that I can't see? With I see hands getting hold of me. Well, I am dead. None can excel. Hip Torrent.
Pretty sure he uses that compass to find every room that he needs to go to for specific tales. Oh, there's a feather. Oh, you're here. Have you been waiting long? Yeah, about nope, a year. we have Welcome to my repository, a vast collection of stories that are dark, frightening, horrific. I. I'm the curator. It's so good to have company. For a long time, I was on my own. I can barely recall a time when I wasn't here, watching over these tales. And what good are stories without somebody to experience them? This is a story about those who create and the lengths they might go to for their art to be made pure. Art can elicit all sorts of reactions. Delight, inspiration, desire, yes, but also doubt, fear, dread. The way you react, the decisions you make, will affect this story. Hidden in the world, you'll find dark pictures. They give glimpses of the possible consequences of your choices. And sometimes it's the smallest choices that can have the biggest repercussions. Repercussions that you will all experience. So I can't basic. interfere. That's very much against the rules. I can only observe what happens and record any significant events. Oh. So basically, so basically, we got to be extremely these. careful this time. They're very time. old. People used to call them obols. They'd put them in the mouth of the recently deceased to pay the ferryman. Look out for them. You'll find them in the strangest places. I'll be happy to exchange any that you find, and I'll certainly make it worth your while. Well, shall we start? The game is afoot. I will be watching. 